for some NBA action. With Hall of Famer Doris Burke and Greg Anthony, this is Kevin Harlan. On the sidelines, we have David Aldridge reporting. We've got the San Antonio Spurs and the Los Angeles Clippers. The offensive rebound. Pass to Parker. Now here's Splitter. Jumps up. Here's Barnes. And Always Parker. feels good getting that first one in the bank. And will that get him rolling? Will it get his team rolling? This should be an interesting night. Now here's Parker. Duncan up on top. Nice ball movement by San Antonio. And Chris Paul. Personal foul. Los Angeles on D. It's a three-point game. And taken away by Paul. And the call will be against him. Think about sending him out. I mean, that's his second foul here in less than a minute. Lines it up for Jordan. Duncan, Duncan the... excels at reading shooters and then altering their shots. Now here's Paul. Five on the clock. Griffin draws the double. From deep. Green with the rebound. Here's San Antonio. Parker outside. For the three. Another shot. Duncan. And it's the Clippers with the rebound. It's all about the defense right there. Without that level of activity, he probably scores it. Duncan with the block. Here's Leonard. Out to Parker. There's the triple. And the dunk by Duncan. And how about the timing from Duncan on the glass? Getting there to collect that offensive rebound and the putback. Down low. It's stolen by Duncan. And here's the fast break. Parker's shot is off. And here's Jordan. He'll bring it up for Los Angeles. The shot by Paul. No good. Well, this is what you call your big man playing big. Terrific work on the glass. Duncan outside. And that one's good. Parker. You love a big man who can pass. Great instincts. Duncan finds the open man there for the bucket. Here's Griffin. Los Angeles with another miss. Uses the glass to finish the lane. Great teamwork punctuated by a strong finish. Going right to the rim, which is where you want transition opportunities to end. Back to Paul. Oh, good on the triple. Spurs leading Two by three. In the first. Oh, and the jam by Leonard. Kawhi Leonard. Well, that's about recognizing a transition opportunity when it presents itself. Nice job by Kawhi Leonard. Back to Griffin. No good again that time. And here's Duncan. He'll bring it up for the San Antonio Spurs. And stolen by Barnes. Now the Clippers moving it up. That shot by Griffin, no good. And that is a textbook example of how to defend your rim. That boy, to have someone back there who can erase your mistakes. What a big time asset defensively. And the foul called by Kawhi Leonard. That is his first foul of the game. A minute 20 left to play in the first. Paul with the ball. Still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring hit from him. And finished off by Griffin. A vintage Blake Griffin finish at the cup. One of the best dunkers in NBA history. Big time. Duncan left side. Parker with a clean look. Off the mark there with a the three-point shot. Boy, he won't miss many from that spot. The defense gets lucky there. Spurs leading by five. Here's Leonard. And Kawhi Leonard with the slam. 
Yeah, and that's what you want from your point guard. Parker distributing the ball wonderfully on that possession. Right side, Griffin. Inside. Here's Jordan. Here's Paul. He gets that one. Oh, boy, I love Chris Paul's ability to work on the interior. Tenacious, crafty. A few players his size have done it better. The D just kind of stepping aside and letting him get to the rim. There's a reason, GA. The lead is what it is right now. I tell you, you can't get stops if you're unwilling to put in the work. Here's Griffin. And the slam by Blake Griffin. Court vision, intellect, basketball IQ, the masterful distributor that is Chris Paul. And so the first quarter is in the books. With the score, it's San Antonio. It is where we're at right now. And looking at what we've seen from the Spurs so far, guys, what do you think? Playing inside out in that first quarter led to some high percentage shots in the paint. It is great when you can get that established early because to me it opens up every other aspect of your game. Five to shoot. Great D that time from Leonard. You, you almost have to assume he's going to knock those down when he is that open. Kawhi Leonard. There's just so much force that Kawhi plays with. It is what allows him to rise up and put it down with authority. Here's Griffin. Morning. And a great assist by Paul as that one goes in. And that's now six points for Blake Griffin. Griffin with the steal. Out to the right wing. The kick out to Barnes. Al Paul. Back to Barnes. His three pointers off the mark. Spurs leading by five. And that one's good. Parker. And able to get it done once again in close. Just one of the ultimate finishers at the rim. To the paint. Griffin with it. Guarded now by Duncan. Nice D from Duncan. Boy, he's at the cup, but that is tremendous defense. Prohibit the lay-in without fouling. Splitter. splitter, that's good. You gotta admire how clever Splitter is. Just uses his height well there on the close range shots. Pass to Jordan. Clippers moving the ball around. Here's Paul. Kicks it out to Jordan. Shot clock at five. And here's Barnes for three. And out of bounds. Second quarter of play with around two minutes gone so far. Parker, right side. Pass to Splitter. San Antonio calls timeout. With a timeout. And so here are the Clippers. The shot, no good. Nice D from Duncan. And that one's good. Parker. Tony Parker. Parker's got the lead up to 11 now for the Spurs. And Parker is the ultimate attacker in the open floor. He gets the ball and doesn't think twice about getting to the rim. Here's Paul. And that one, good. Paul's got his second basket of the game. It really has been a major aspect of their offense in the early stages here. Their success working the ball inside and getting points from close range. Nobody near Leonard. Connects from three-point range. Leonard's got five points now in the quarter. To the inside. Paul. No good that time. And the Spurs going the other way now. Here's Green. It's great whenever Danny Green is forcing the issue. He puts the defender in a tough spot there. He hits both from the strike. And here is Paul. Guys, they're looking for a way to score here. Yeah, they've had a tough time taking the lid off. And let's head over to the sideline and catch up with the NBA has opened several international academies. 
Commissioner Adam Silver says huge numbers of people are playing basketball, but unless you take the best at a young age, get them facing elite competition and training under high pressure circumstances, they won't develop into NBA caliber players. Kevin? Well, opening doors, David, that's always a good thing. Expansion, thank you. Back to, Back to Parker. Clippers trail by 12. To the middle. It's stolen by Duncan. Leonard with the ball. Chris Paul covering to the left side wing. To the inside. And stolen by Barnes. Down low. And the slam by Blake Griffin. Oh, Blake Griffin at one time, the best athlete in the league, showing off his skills athletically again. I love it. Hunter on the wing. To the paint. Here's Duncan. And the dunk by Duncan. Well, known for being a terrific passer, he shows you right there. Case in point. And it's Paul with the ball for the Los Angeles Clippers. Down by 12. The kick out to Barnes. Reddick for three. Rebound San Antonio. Here's Parker. And that comes off the assist by Duncan. Parker's got six points in the quarter. Boy, they wasted no time getting the ball up the court. Great decision to push it and make the sharp pass to the rim. And so that's the end of the first half. The the first half. Spurred. The score. Your Clippers, 17. The Spurs, 31. We'll see if things play out a little more evenly here in the second. And the foul is called. First team foul. Paul outside. Pass to Griffin. All sorts of time. Tim Duncan with the rebound. All by himself, trying to step up. He's got to be frustrated with the miss. Clippers trail by 14. Paul, right side. Left side, Griffin. That one doesn't go. And the Spurs going the other way now. Here's Parker. And Jordan sends it back. This is not the guy you want in your zip code when the ball is going up. DeAndre Jordan twice on the pipes. Here's Paul. Can't hit the turnaround jumper. Spurs leading by 14. Parker's shot is off. Well, we didn't see the same kind of control we're used to seeing from him. This guy is usually a tremendous finisher. That'll be his second, second foul of the game. Foul. First team foul. Leonard looking over the floor. Duncan at the elbow. It's Parker outside. Kept alive. Well, Kawhi Fink and what it can give you. The Spurs have gone two for two in the game at the line. At the line for the Spurs. Kawhi. Hits one, then misses the second attempt from the free throw line. Oh, no one around him. And the Clippers miss again. I'll tell you, this has not been his game, and he's making it worse with shot selection oh, like that. And buckets like that have been hard to come by. Not the most exciting game. Both sides look way off in terms of their shooting. Well, you have to appreciate the defensive battle for sure. Both squads struggling on the offensive on, end. We call this grit and grind. And I think that play sort of sums up what we've seen tonight. Just simply being outplayed both sides of the ball. Smart basketball defensively turning into easy points. Paul with the bucket. And this is such a sharp weapon for Chris Paul, right? Most times you just assume he's going to knock that three ball down. Parker with it. Chris Paul covering. Looking to get back on track here. And it's laid in by Parker. Parker's got 12 in the game. 
when you allow good scorers to get uncontested shots at the rim, no wonder you're losing. Right. To me, this has simply stated been a complete lack of defensive attention and focus all night long. And Duncan gets double teamed. Pass to Splitter. And Green now, top of the key. A three from Leonard. Good. Go on, Great Leonard. play by Green to set it up. Well, Kawhi understands that the team relies on him for consistent productivity. Griffin shot is off. And his defense, so valuable. Not many can bother that shot at the rim. Boy, you see the effort. You see the range. This guy prides himself in his ability to shut you down. LA and the whistle free throw coming up. Yeah, just terrific touch from the big fella. Splitter taking the hit like a champ and just finishing with ease. Pass to Barnes. The shot's good Great. from Griffin. 14 points Assist for Blake Griffin. And that solid play in the paint continues here, guys. Out left to the wing. Parker surveying the floor. Outside Leonard. Knocked away. And taken away by Paul. Inside. Griffin with it. Guarded now by Duncan. And the slam by Blake Griffin. Blake Griffin has been in attack mode so far this game. You love watching him get this steady offensive production going. Redick is in the corner. He's looking for Griffin and finds him. Great D that time from Duncan. San Antonio leading by 17. Here's Parker. Takes it out to Leonard. From the arc. Trains the three-pointer. Leonard's got two now from beyond the arc in the third for the Spurs. This guy loves to help his team space the floor. You have to respect Kawhi's range. He will make you pay. Griffin's shot is off. And no need to rush this. Let the Tony clock Parker. run down. Well, Assisted it's trying to close the quarter strong. And by that, take a great shot without giving them an opportunity for another one down the other end. Here's Griffin. Misses off the right iron. Listen, he can make that shot right there, but I do know they have the other options they can go to. Score. Kawhi Your Clippers, 26. Great job. Spurs leading by 22. Hey, ball, ball. Here's Ginobili. Splitter trying to break free. And it's blocked by Jordan. Ball left side. Fires the three. Good, and it's Barnes picking up the assist. Well, Chris Paul is usually the guy to deliver the pass. In this instance, getting to the catch-and-shoot game. Go ahead, Chris. Let your teammates make it easy on you. Duncan drawing the double team. And a bit of a battle here for the ball. And here is Los Angeles now. Tries again. It's on J.J. Reddick. First team. A tremendous score with the ball in his hands. Duncan, the for the just Spurs. too much for the D to Tim handle. Duncan. He hits the second from the line. And so it's Paul bringing it up for the Los Angeles Clippers. Spurs Paul with the ball. Pass to Griffin. And finished off by Griffin. He's put on a show for these fans. I can't believe he pulled that one out. That's his third, That's his third foul of the game. Second team foul. Leonard draws the double. Parker outside. Duncan right side. Over Paul. Offensive rebound. Boy, Blake Griffin putting the clamps on defensively. Love the contest right there. Basket counts. And you're not going to pass up that kind of win. San Antonio leading by 16. Here's to pick up the points at the line. And a breakdown here, guys. The hustle stats for the Spurs. No adjustments made by the other team, and they couldn't defend against the speed of this group. They've been running over them in this one. 
I think fans can appreciate Kawhi's understated and quiet personality because between the lines, there's a level of focus and competitive spirit and most importantly, productivity that you can really appreciate. At this time, is tough to come back from. These are the kinds of plays that can be game changers, that can make you hang your head. Parker. Tony Parker. Drops in the layup for two. And this is what we've come to expect from this guy, right? Not only making a ton of shots, but being efficient while doing so. The shot's good from Paul. Paul for two. Paul's got seven points for the quarter. How about that move? Is this guy special or what? Just Tim love Duncan. watching him operate inside. Yeah, he, he's shown terrific control of the pace and the rhythm of this offense. And I think they count on him for that. He is a tone setter, extremely unselfish. Griffin's shot is off. That's not his spot, but given the lack of defense, you'd like to see him knock that one down. Clippers trail by 19. Going inside. And the slam by Blake Griffin. What you love about Blake Griffin, first and foremost, this guy is a tremendous competitor. Puts it on the deck off the drive. Nice. Hundred on the wing. Two minutes remaining in the game. Two minutes. Back to Duncan. With the shot. Out to Parker. Shot clock at three. Splitter. And it's good on the assist by Parker. And the Spurs lead by 19. San Antonio, second team box. And there's a minute 45 left in the fourth quarter. Reddick for three. And the defense from Parker really helps change the direction of the shot, using his speedy hands there incredibly well. Al Paul. And the basket is good. And that's what he does. I mean, he is a bucket getter. Spurs leading by 19 points. Splitter misses. It's stolen by Green. Leonard with the ball. Chris Paul covering. And yes, that's good. Leonard's got 14 points now in the second half. Well, Kawhi Leonard meets the defender at the rim, and he comes out on top. Here's Griffin. The kick out to Barnes. Paul looking around. Oh, and they get in the way of the alley-oop. Not to be. Good play defensively. Got a piece of it. And stolen by Barnes. Here's Griffin, Tim Duncan with the rebound. And it's still a rare sight to see rebound numbers like the ones he's had tonight. His production has been unbelievable, a testament to how much he cares about his craft. And finished off by Griffin. I mean, this is one of the best point guards the NBA has ever seen. Chris Paul doing work with the pass. Outside Green. Nice ball movement by San Antonio. Kicks it out to Leonard. A three-pointer off the mark. Here's Griffin. And a great assist by Paul as that one goes in. Well, this is where Blake does a lot of his damage. He is such a tough matchup in the painted area. And so it's San Antonio, he easily taken this one. To come into an opponent's building and dominate the way they did tonight says, I think, Greg, an awful lot about this team. I guess they don't you have a secret home. <laughs> feel at home. I mean, Kevin, just a masterful performance all the way around. Well, folks, that's going to do it for now.